Most definitely. You mind if I lay this down and take yeah, a look at it? it. Oh. Okay. Just being all the uh, role playing games and all that kind of stuff. Oh, yeah. I played it a couple years ago just to see if they get back into it. Can't and do the it. Loading screens take so long. Yeah, they do. <laughs> oh, man, I get spoiled with the new stuff. Oh yeah, but shoot, the new stuff takes an hour just to freaking download. Right. <laughs> I guess the turnout's a little bit better, you know, in graphics and oh, yeah. faster games. Yeah, right, right on. That's good. So it might be used little cleanup, but as far as I know, it all still works just like it's supposed to. Oh yeah. It's only three discs in there. At one point, I did have a bunch of Nintendo games, but I'm not sure where they went. Well, if you come across them, you let me know. Okay, I'm sort of doing a total cleanup on a little farm piece. We've got a couple sheds here and there. And yeah. So everything's in good storage. It just has, a, just has to be gone through. You know? Right. Okay. That looks good. I guess that's for a PS2 or something, maybe for the internet. Or I, I'm not really sure it was with. The I don't pile. even know. I've it never seen that. It, it does say Sony it on it. With the pile and said Sony, so I said I'd throw it on there. I yeah. It. We got power cable. There's three of those, I think. Yep. Just a switch, Nintendo Switch, I'm not sure what that's Yeah, about. RF cables, mm -hmm. right on. Nintendo 64, see I saw this, I was like, well maybe he's got a 64. No, I, that's I did a power cable. Point, but I'm not sure where it's at either. So I, yeah. I probably got some more stuff laying around somewhere, but this was just from one bedroom. Right on. AV cables, that's always good. Happens. The other games, I actually found one of the games in it, and then I, I guess I didn't check the other ones. So I said, let me check both of them just to make sure. Yeah, not bad. I'll clean them up and I refurbish these, and I've got a whole bunch of games I can bundle up with them and make somebody else happy. Heck yeah. Cool. And so, you, 60 bucks? Yeah. All right, man. There you go. I appreciate it. Yes, sir. Thank you. Get all this. Okay, folks, we got a big package in today. It's been quite some time since I've received any mail. Uh, this is coming from Bethesda, Ohio. I have no idea what it is um, or who it's from. If I'm not mistaken, I've sent packages to Bethesda, Ohio before. So this possibly could be from that person. Um, but I'm not sure. So we'll get on into it. All right. And oh 
Oh my god. Okay, so somebody sent me a birthday gift. And uh it's from yeah, it's from Ted Man73. I've uh I've sent him plenty of items before, but he sent me some birthday stuff, which is which is awesome. I, you know, I didn't even announce it was my birthday, so I guess he just remembered. Um but it says Ted Collector, happy birthday. Here's some shit, Ted Man73. <laughs> That's awesome, dude. Alright, let's see. Got some some bubble wrap, which is always nice. Alright. Love this big bubble wrap. First thing we got here is... Oh, that's cool. Yeah. It's a Batman glass. Um, yeah, we'll have to go ahead and take a look at this. This looks cool. Oh, yeah. Yes. Look at that. That is cool. Very awesome. With some bubble wrap on the inside. Packed very well. Ted man, thank you. Thank you so much, dude. Yeah, I will be drinking my sweet tea out of that for sure. All right. Next up, we got a box here. Oh, dude, I didn't have this controller. Yes! We got the gold N64 controller. Heck yeah! Yeah, this is one that I, I have not found yet. Um, I have no clue how he knew that I needed this. I have no clue how he knew that I needed this. I haven't found the console and I haven't found any of the controllers. It's in very good condition. Got a really nice tight stick on it say a good nine out of ten on that yes Ted man thank you that is going up on the wall of n64 controllers for sure man these are some cool birthday gifts man <laughs> what is this man justice league cheese nips look at that oh yeah oh yeah these are getting eaten tonight. Got a uh, Superman, Wonder Woman, Flash, Cyborg, Batman, and Aquaman. Yes. Yeah, that's cool right there. Yeah, those are getting eaten for sure. Faux show. Sure. And the last item. Oh, yes. Oh, Ted Man. Yeah, I did yourself with this one, buddy. Oh, this is so cool. It's a Friday the 13th Jason Voorhees lunchbox. Yes. Okay, for those of, of you that don't know, um, my passions lie within video games, Batman, and horror. I'm a huge horror fan. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, that's that's going to get displayed nicely. But that's it. That is the birthday haul right there. We got the Batman glass, the awesome gold N64 controller, some cheese nips and Friday the 13th lunchbox. Ted man, you have outdone yourself. Thank you so much for remembering my birthday. You didn't have to send anything, um, but I thank you. I thank you so much. How about take a look? Yeah, go ahead. All right, man. Yeah, that'll work. Huh? That'll work. All right. Here's 40. All right. I appreciate it. Appreciate it. Thank you. Yes, sir. Uh, the Samson one. 
Um, our boy showed up this morning from uh, Fort Stewart. She's my buddy Fort Stewart. So, oh, okay. Someone I don't have. Okay. Um, there's all of them, but these three right here, all those together is 50, if not five of these. And these three, this one's brand spanking. This is the only different price. And this one right here is 50 yeah. because it's never even been open. That's fine. And oh. these two right here are 10 because they've never even been destroyed. Okay. Let's see right here. Let's see right here. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna take these two okay. right here. Okay. So you want five each? Uh huh. Okay. Alright, there's ten. Okay. Alright, I appreciate it. You too. Thank you.
Okay, YouTube, picked up some awesome things this week, and this is what I've got left. I've already sold quite a bit of it, and then a lot of this, as you see on the table, is for sale as well. But, start off the week picking up three Nintendos, two being the uh, toaster style, one being a top loader, my very first top loader I've ever found, and then an original PS1, the PS1 Slim, uh, and these three games, Legend of Dragoon, Final Fantasy IX, and inside this case is Final Fantasy VII. Legend of Dragoon was uh, Black Label, so I swapped out my copy for the Greatest Hits, um, or I switched out my copy of Greatest Hits for the Black Label, so I'm keeping the Black Label selling this one. Came with a copy of Bases Loaded, uh, the NES Advantage, this complete uh, PS1 Slim. It is tested, it does work. And uh, the three Nintendos that I picked up with that bundle, all of them have sold. I sold uh, three NES bundles in one day, like two days ago. One for $60, or excuse me, two for $60, and then one for $150. Uh, the $60 were bundled with two controllers, a Zapper and Mario Duck Hunt. Um, I'm, I'm able to flip them for $60 bucks very frequently, very quick. The $150 lot I had listed for, I don't know, about two weeks, and it finally sold. The top loader sold on eBay for $120 free ship. Um, and then I picked this one up, actually... Uh, Friday night for 40 bucks. The guy that I bought this from, he actually bought this same lot from me. So he hit me up and said, hey, you want to buy some old games? I don't think he realized at the time when he messaged me that I am the one that sold him this lot. When I met him in person, we got a chit-chatting uh, after we made the exchange. And um, I, I told him, I was like, yeah, I sold this to you. But I was able to get this lot for 40 bucks. We got one controller, the Zapper, the RF cable, the Power Cable, Mario Duck Hunt, Super Mario Bros. 2, Ninja Turtles, Baseball, Top Gun, RC Pro-Am, Mock Rider, and Anticipation. I've already got that relisted. It's in the same condition I sold it to him in. It's in super clean condition. Um, it's completely refurbished and fires up and works like a dream. Today, I found Silent Hill 2 Greatest Hits. If you do not know, the Greatest Hits version of Silent Hill 2 sells for more than the Black Label. That's not usually the case, but in this case it is because they added new content to the Greatest Hits version. Uh, so it does sell for more than the Black Label. And then Castlevania Curse of Darkness. Silent Hill 2 is just case and disc only. Uh, they were a little bit scratched, but I put them in the JFJ and uh, resurface them and they work like a dream now. Castlevania Curse of Darkness is complete. And that's it folks, there you have it. If you've enjoyed the content, well, actually this is, uh, Castlevania is what I'm keeping. If anyone wants to know what I'm keeping for the collection, that would be Castlevania. But there you have it, that's, that's all she wrote. If you've enjoyed the content, by all means hit that thumbs up. If you have not subscribed yet, be sure to hit that subscribe button and be sure to hit the bell icon while you're at it when you do you're going to receive notifications every single time i upload new content hope you've had a fantastic week i know i have i'm tatted collector and have a good one